Hey guys, today I'm doing the what's on my phone tag and I think nobody would actually care what's on my phone but I'm just doing this tag for fun and here's my phone, it's my it's iPhone 4S and I'm currently using my brother's phone which is exactly the same phone as me to um, record so the quality will be the same because I don't have a camera so let's just get on with what's on my phone and I have this really great app called PP and it's um, in Chinese, but I understand Chinese so I know how it works. But it's actually not an app. You can't find it in the App Store on Android phones because I found this on the internet and I downloaded it from the internet and connected to my phone so it transferred over to my phone. But um, I searched on the App Store and it's not actually an app but it helps to download paid apps for free. Then I have... A lot of games yeah I have a lot of games and then as you can see here I have the usual apps like WhatsApp Facebook Instagram oh my gosh sorry um YouTube Twitter like I think everyone would have these apps and for Instagram this is my account at duckbones underscore you can go follow if you want because as you can see I only have like 34 followers and I recently joined bubble tea xf giveaway then, um, like for Shazam, Shazam is actually like, if you don't know what Shazam is, it's like, um, I'll just show you. It's like an app which you can touch and then you listen to a random song which is playing, then it will recognize the song for you and tell you what the song is if you don't know what's the song. Like, example, you... You are listening to a random song on radio, but you don't know what's that song, so you can like touch Shazam and then it will like recognize the song for you. For those photo and video editing apps, I have Game Your Video and it's a really great video editing app. <coughs> and I'll show you how it works. It can like trim your video, like edit your video, trim your videos, and merge your videos, reverse your videos, split your videos and etc. So it has a lot of functions and can even like put text um, in your videos and I'll show you how it works. And I've already trimmed the video which I showed you just now and it's really cool and convenient to trim it because you just need to tap the middle button over here, the middle white button to start trimming and it will just, this bar will just move from the part which you press start trimming and um, it will end at the part which you press the white button once again so that it will stop trimming if you get what I mean. To show you guys how it works, I've already reversed a random video of me squishing a squishy and I'll just show you the effect. Yeah, you can still see the hand um, at the last part, You can, but you can trim that part off. So I'm just going to tap done and plate so that's pretty fast and you can't see the part where my hand is shown already so that's really cool and there are a lot of other functions which I'm not gonna show you because if I show you all the functions this video will be very for the long. picture editing apps I have doodles and pixart and pixart is a really great app because you can just select which photo to edit in your camera roll and you can add overlays to your photos and for doodles it's just the same thing then I have a couple of games like Oven Break 2, Happy Street Sprinkle, uh, the Toka series games, Dumb Ways to Die, Rainy Day, Tiny Tower, Hardest Game Ever 2, Tiny Thief, Y Mula, Mushroom Deluxe and it's Namiko so it's really cute but I don't really play Namiko this now make called green game anymore because I um I really I got really bored of it. Then I have swiped fruits, cookie ram, piano tower, school idol, Jacob Jones, Devil's Attorney, Detective Grimoire. G I don't know how to pronounce. Sorry, and Subway Surfers and Cooking Mama Season Pro. And a few of my favorites are Detective Grimoire or something. Then um Jacob Jones and Devil's Attorney. These games are like really fun and I really like Jacob Jones. It's like it's like an adventure game. But I'm just gonna show you dumb ways to die. 
and it's really cute. It's just a series of games. Okay, I don't want to um, show you the game too long. If not, the video will be too long. And then I'm gonna make cupcake. A few of my favourites are Jacob Jones, Devils, Attorney and Detective Gilmore. I don't know how to pronounce that, so I'm sorry. And if any of you guys have ever played before Professor Layton on Nintendo DS, Jacob Jones is something like Professor Layton, only that um, the puzzles are easier and less complicated than Professor Layton's puzzles. And I seriously don't know why they keep crashing. And I was playing Devil's Attorney just now and it was perfectly fine but it keeps crashing now. I can't even play it but never mind. I'm just gonna show you piano tiles. I think you guys might have heard of this game because it's quite popular now. And oh my god. I think you get the idea of piano tiles. So for mushroom deluxe, whoa, they are all weeded because I haven't played this game forever. But last time I'm so addicted to this game. I really love this game last time, but um. It gets really boring after a while, so I don't really play it now. But I think you know how this game works. It's just like... um, It's actually quite a boring game after a while. At first, it, it's really cute and interesting, but after a while, it's really boring. But it's just like growing Namekos on a log. And that's all for what's on my phone. Tech. I hope you enjoy this video. Bye!